Uh, let's get you the machine pistol. Combat supplier. Okay, sweet. That's actually good for us. Matthias, you're melee, right? Yes. Okay, so you're going to grab a thrombo horn. We've got... Warner needs a thrombo horn. Just go, go get the thrombo horn now. Misery needs a thrombo horn. Bueller needs a thrombo horn. Oh, my M's got one. Kami Pulu needs one. Oh, right down there. There we go. All right, everybody's got their thrombo horns. Deer are eating my tomatoes. I set the deer to a fence, but my pawns no work. Uh, they might not be high enough level to rope them. Try right-clicking and see if you can rope them. Katsumi, go talk. Katsumi's a level 15, or level 12 social with a high interest. Insect jelly. No! Um, do you have good guns? No, you don't have anything. You have marine armor. I want that. Marine armor, get. I do, I do want that. We can sell you all this crap here. Because I don't need it. I don't need any of this. I don't need any of that. I'm going to keep the revolver, though. I'm going to keep all the revolvers, probably. Minus 1,000. Silver spear. Sell these. Minus 1,500. Gross. I can sell you Yayo! <laughs> Don't tempt me. I can sell you the smoke leaf that I got off of a dude. Let's see. Can I sell? <laughs> sure, let's sell a stack. We'll sell a stack to this guy. You've not played in like three days. I don't want to turn my save on. I was attacked by 40 people, and before I could even get my people to the hospital beds, I have another attack of like 12. Yep. Anyone have spare donuts? I can get you all the donuts you want, Hades. We're the home of, of Dunkin' or Krispy Kreme over here. I can get you Krispy Kreme donuts until you turn blue in the face. You'll be like, please, no more donuts. And I'll be like, nope. Not what you said. Not what you said. Not what you said. Please? I mean... You live in North Carolina, too! There's a Duncan right next to you! Or not a Duncan, but a, uh, uh, what's it called? A Krispy Kreme. You love Krispy. They're right next to you. You have Gator here, and Gator's not as good as Krispy Kreme. TJ, it's because you're not, you, you don't get the hot and ready ones. When they come out of the factory and they're fresh and they're being delivered and you buy them for $2 a dozen, that's when they're perfect. They're too sweet. But that's what it, a donut's supposed to be sweet. It's a, it's a sweet. <laughs> You're poor hashtag spare change. You have a job. You shouldn't be poor, forehead. <laughs> Sorry, I had to say that. You're not a big fan of donuts. Okay, well, that's why you don't like them, then. But but when it comes to being a donut, they're, like, the best donuts. They are the best. Well, you should have just said you don't like donuts. By pointing out a specific brand, you're, you're kind of not... Just say you don't like donuts. <laughs> Why you gotta be so rude? Um, we got people that are. Oh, you're researching. Oh, I'm gonna, I'm gonna let you research. I'm gonna let you research. Hell yeah! Get your intellect up, boy. Go, 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 go. College student with no job or money. You have a job? What happened to your job? You'll have intimate donuts, no problem. Well, that's not really a donut. But sure.
Come on, guys. Come up here. Let's trade. Watch out for the traps. <laughs> Don't step on the traps. Boom, 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 boom. Okay, so we're good here. We got plenty of stuff. We're running out of steel, which kind of sucks. We're going to need to get to a bulk goods trader pretty fast. 13 eggs. How are we on eggs in here? Uh, we have 74 eggs. Holy cow. Here, trade with them since you're right there. You want my clothes. You can have them. Take my crappy clothes. That's almost everything. Um, Take your medicine. And then I will sell you yeah, 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 yeah. I'm back. What's up, Matthias? Everything's going great, buddy. You had to leave your job for school. That sucks. Is there not a job around campus you can pick up? Active. Okay, so we can deconstruct this. Did we ever put a roof here? Oh, we didn't because we got that. Hell yeah. Let's deconstruct. Matthias, we just had to deal with a six nest infest <coughs> a six nest infestation, but otherwise we're doing all right. Almost died there for a second. Donovan is down for four more days. Hey, we got a little dude. Carrier Dryad 1. Hell yeah. Go nuts, my friend. Look at him go. Create healing pond. If this creature is injured, it'll return to its current connected tree. Look at it hauling. Oh, that's so cool. Okay, nice. Just lurking while you read about pickles. No worries, buddy. You have a job on campus, but it only pays monthly. Oh, that kind of sucks, huh? Nice. All right, cool. We got a carrier dry yet. That makes me happy. We can have four, so we're going to have a lot of carriers. We probably won't need them after a certain amount of time, but at least we'll have them. Bye, Izzy. Have fun. that I won't be living in New Jersey in three weeks. It's crazy, huh? Moving is exciting, but it's also stressful, but it's also existential. For sure. But you know what? New journey, new cool stuff. Look at that. Everything's built. I'm so proud of my build. It all looks so good. Our wealth at it dipped a little bit just then when we sold and traded or that was the that was the bugs we used some medicine and we lost some things get in new journey what okay nikki b's on the night shift cleaning up the area a siege oh shit all right, well, I'm calling for help. Screw that noise. Uh, color, go call for help. Call... Um... Call the Shattered Empire, go for it. Screw that noise, I'm not gonna go fight a siege. Thanks. <laughs> Screw you and your siege! Screw you and your siege! Alright, good deal. And then I started blasting. There's a sniper rifle. There's an assault rifle. Hell yeah. 
Some good weapons here for us. Get wrecked, Siegers. They didn't put their stuff down or call for the for the items, but I'm okay with that. We'll, we'll cut them off at the PS. Cut them off at the PS. Thanks, guys. You're all awesome. I guess you lost somebody there. They... Well, you can tell a dead person from the Shattered Empire because they're naked. They have on them what's called a death acidifier. It, it acidifies all their gear. That way no one can take it from them. Also, botates. Um, that assault rifle. That's going to be... That's game changing. Ultrasaurus. You're going to come grab this assault rifle. And then these machine pistols are going to be great. We can start upgrading some of our... Some of our revolvers to those. You have a revolver? I want you to grab it. It's bio-coded. Shit. Yours is good. Yours is normal. Yours is poor. It's a machine pistol, though. Oh. <laughs> LMG, baby. We got a party going on. Hell yeah. That's him. I don't mean to make you run all the way out here, but it's important. What's up, CT man? Welcome in, buddy. It's okay, dude. I'm glad you're here. Hope you're well. So, Color's going to get this after the... Oh, no. They're, they're sleeping. Go get it now. You're doing fine? Sweet, dude. Thanks for being here. And enjoy your sub. Build roof area. Yeah, I guess we can roof the eggs. That way they're protected from anything. They don't get radioactive and stuff. <laughs> they pooped a little egg out. <clears throat> 17 eggs. All right, so I can call them one more time for help. No, I can't. All right, we got to do some missions to get friendly with them again. You always enjoy free gifts. Hell yeah, man. Free gifts are great. Twenty four hundred steel. So we did see some steel poking out. Over here, that's right, we can cut this up. Uh, Bueller's still a one, right? He sure is. Cold snap is over. Okay, it didn't really affect us at all. See, we're not we're not really affected by any adverse weather that comes through here. We're just fine. You okay, bud? A little beat up, you'll be fine. Ooh, Donovan. Donovan's going to be up soon. We're going to go ahead and get him set up and ready to go. Tommy Pulu, have you zapped anyone yet recently? Stop. I want you to zap Donovan. Thanks. 36%. Okay. Man. Zap. Exactly. That's what I call it, man. Now, this is supposed to be like insect jelly and stuff, right? Yeah. Oh, that's why. Because this is preferred. And this is important. Taking the jelly out. So let's be over here in the fun area. If this game was cheaper, you'd pick it up. It's on sale right now for 10% off on Humble Bundle. Exclamation point Humble. I got a partner link. If you buy it through there, uh, you support me and Direct Relief. I think it's 27 at the moment. It, it never goes on sale, CT man. This is like the first time in a long time. But that's gonna be the best price for a while. Yeah, 
if you are interested. But this game's pretty great for the most part. I'm enjoying it. Bio-coded. Sniper rifle's good to have, too. See, that's good. Okay, who has a normal handgun? Yours is good. Yours is normal. Come over here and get this. You have a machine pistol. Thrumbo horn. Thrumbo horn. Thrumbo horn. Thrumbo horn. Thrumbo horn. Thrumbo horn. Okay, cool. <laughs> Mr. Greater Than? No, I didn't. What's a good starting biome? So there's two that I would uh, that I would suggest. Uh, but mainly, I would start in a temperate forest and try to go close to the equator, the center part of the planet. Because if you do like a, a temperate forest up here, you're going to have colder temperatures. It shows you the temperature range. So go close to the equator and find a temperate forest. That way you don't have to worry about so much cold. The other place you can do is a, a permanent summer swamp. Or not swamp, jungle. But those can be uh, hard because of diseases. So tropical rainforest here. Or, or a jungle. Because it's always summer and it's really warm. And you can grow crops all year long. But you can get diseases in there. You gotta be careful. Yeah, Kamipulu. That, that's, that's my whole argument about it too. No problem, color. But yeah, do a temperate forest biome right right along the equator. You'll be fine. So Donovan is good at shooting and melee. He's got a he's got a knack for melee though. Ultra Source put on the marine armor. <laughs> okay. Sure. Near a road ideally, but make sure you're not really close to like a skull. If you zoom out a bit, you can see skulls. Don't get too close to one of those. Get close to someone else. But yeah, along a road is ideal. Because it makes your caravans move a little faster. Like if you set up a camp like right here, you're going to have a hard time getting out because you got to go through the mountains. It takes you a lot more days and stuff. And these, these dark mountains right here are impassable. So you can't even go over those. So you have to go all the way around to get to somewhere. It, it's a mess. I think eventually they do, but it, it takes too long. And Can I convert them to a regular? I have no idea, Matthias. Slaves are new, and I have not done those yet. I would assume so, but you may have to re-arrest them again. You may have to, re to arrest them and drop their resistance and then recruit them. You can't just, like, swap them while they're standing around. They're going to have a debuff minus six because they were imprisoned, but if you want them on your team, it's worth it. But yeah, you can, it, to, to arrest people, it's easy. What you do is you, is you, um, you draft them, you right click on someone and you say arrest. It, it's super easy to arrest people. Hades, it's a normal thing in this game. This game is like a war crime simulator. But they is his melee, right? Let's move him down here. I get him confused with Katsumi all the time. All right, traitor. I forgot what you were, but let's see what you've got. You've got Plasteel. I think I want to buy that. You've got no components. Oh, I got you. Yeah. You gotta rearrest them then probably. Can I can I take on alpacas? Probably not worth it. Hmm. No, because I want to take pigs with us to the next place. And you're in my rim world, of course you are. I thought you knew that already. But yes, you are in there. Let's grab 10 gold. Let's sell some herbal medicine. Let's sell um, 136 herbal medicine. That'll clean that storage out a little bit. 
And then I can sell some Yayo. Sell 43 Yayo. 774. Almost the, all their money. Sweet. Thank you. And none of this stuff right here deteriorates outside, so we can sit out here for a while until it gets hauled. Yeah, you've been here for a while now. You're not really good at much, but you're our plant guy. Body modder frustrated. Okay. Do you need anything? Right lung. Oh. We need a lung. Gotta keep that in mind. Next time we get a raid, I gotta get a lung off of somebody. Look at us go. We're chopping up blocks. Beautiful. All right, we're cleaning up the battlefield over here now. We're kind of slow getting out there, but it's a it's a process. We're at ninety nine percent. We got one dryad out of four. Next dryad spawning in twenty two hours. It's gonna take a few days to come out of its cast, and then it'll be good to go. We're keeping the drugs a flowing. Seven hundred and five yayo and adding to it. How are you? 6.9 resistance, chat. Nice. They're going to be another kind of just slave worker. They're just going to do BS work for us. How do you get an organ off of a dead person? You don't. You don't without mods. You have to get them off of someone who's still alive. So we're going to take somebody prisoner and then take their organs. I usually grab a few extra. I'll take a, I'll take a lung, a kidney, and then we can either take... Um, another lung, another kidney, a heart, or a liver, and then they die. It also levels up your medical, because sometimes you fail and you have to heal them again. We don't have a good doctor right now. All of our doctors suck. All of our doctors are, like, levels four to six. They're all really, really bad. And this person here is no better. That's a tribal start for you. You don't get good doctors. I would love to get a doctor on my team, but for like future when we go to the next colony or something. But it hasn't happened yet. Is Ultra Source currently high on Yayo? They're not. Yeah, Goalie Bear, 100%. I would take them from them, but I need them for my colony. So we're currently reducing the resistance. But if this was an actual prisoner, we would take it along in a heartbeat. Why not, right? No, if I could take organs from dead people, we'd have so much money right now. I would just take organs from everybody. Easy. Two hundred and fifty medicine. We got. We only got one hydroponic basin growing. Medicine. We had six, but we had. We, we just got too much medicine too fast. But uh, medicine takes roughly, I think, eight days to grow. Seven days, and in here it only takes about four. So we're gonna be, get about four medicine uh, every four days. As long as we don't burn through that, we should be fine. And then we got regular medicine in the in the meantime. Which hopefully we can start making actual medicine, but we need to um, we need to reach a certain point here. We need to build a high tech research bench, and I haven't done it yet. I don't know if I want this to be my production room or not. It's still here, but I don't know if I want it to be here or not. A lot of these things can't be like moved. They can only be deconstructed and rebuilt. Which is why I'm hesitant. But if I put production, it would be right here. That way we can get around, get up, work on our stuff, and then get out. It's fast to bed. It's convenient. I don't need any more space for anything else. Uh, we might get a couple more colonists here and there, but I don't think we're going to need too many more. I think we have probably the maximum 
all of our jobs have someone doing them. We're pretty, we're pretty on point with getting meals and stuff kept up. Everyone's pretty happy. Hmm. Harps of cord, don't care about any of that. Cocoa tree. You know what? Let's get the cocoa. Maybe we'll do a cocoa tree. Get some chocolate for our folks. There's a dromedary that died due to our auto slaughter because we got two full-grown dromedaries. We got three full-grown dromedaries. Uh-oh. Another one of y'all about ready to die. I'll be that one. Oh, no. Soon. Oh, boy. Oh, yeah. One of y'all about ready to die soon. Sorry, though. Unless you're all pregnant. Are we all pregnant? Yep. There's one not pregnant and one that is pregnant. So the other one gets pregnant before the other one gives birth. We can't slaughter any of them. Well, we'll slaughter the one that gives birth, no? Yeah, they, they, they both have to be not pregnant. Late stage. Pergante. And we're growing this little bit of fungus to kind of just replenish this from time to time. It's, it's more than what we need. But this is more than what we need right now, too. Sweet. Oh, we got steel up here. Let's get some more. That looks like an opening. See how you can see both sides of the steel here? This might be an open area right here where we're, we're going to be revealing soon. Entropy. English only. But yes. <laughs> Please and thank you. <clears throat> Mi amigo. God, oh my, you're so slow. Why are you mining? Stop mining. Oh, I got you. Oh, yep, see, that's, a, that's an opening. It's gonna be revealed. Please don't be bugs, please don't be bugs. Okay, that's not too bad. All right, it's not too bad. <laughs> I'm not scared of it anymore. We should be making Das Hibbit also mine. He has a he has a passion for mining, but he sucks at it right now. His skills are five, but I got him doing all kinds of stuff. I just want everything hauled. Second cast. For five days? Oh come on. Ew, look at that. I gotta take this floor up. Remove floor, please. I should go ahead and do that down here, too. We got some concrete here that we don't need. That'll get us a little bit of more, more steel. And then we can actually work on deconstructing like all this stuff here and getting it off the map, at least. This stuff here, we have to attack it to destroy it. Um... These things here we can deconstruct. That's something we gotta beat up to destroy. There's a dude that hasn't been buried yet. 